A lot of you called us here at the station today yeah. wondering what that strange ring was around the sun, John. That's right, Bob. It's called the halo. We'll talk more about it during the show right now. But at 10 o'clock under fair skies in El Paso, we're at 82 degrees, 80 in Las Cruces, relative humidity 15%. Dew point, 30 degrees, barometer rising 29.95, and the winds out of the northwest at 3. The high today, 100 big ones, folks, after a morning low of 63. No rain today, 2.10 so far for the year. The satellite loop goes into motion. I step in front of it and tell you that Tropical Storm Cosme that left all the moisture down by Houston Way continues pushing a lot of moisture there. Up to 10 inches of rain may fall even into the evening hours along Louisiana, back into Texas, along the Gulf Coast. A lot of rain down there. The other weather story right up here in the state of Nebraska. Numerous tornadoes reported today in central Nebraska with damage up there. So that's the big weather story. Storms up in the Midwest and along the East Coast, spotty down toward Florida. And around here, we just could not generate anything toward El Paso. It all stayed right down south of the area. Now let's talk about that halo today. A lot of people called on it. That's a 22 degree halo we call that. That shows you the presence of ice crystals which refract or bend visible light. And that's the angle between the sun and the halo is seen by the observer. That's you and I is 22 degrees. Therefore it's the 22 degree halo. And the reason is sunlight comes through these large hexa hexagonal, I can say it, ice crystals that are scattered in the atmosphere and that's what creates that effect. So, hope you saw it today. Interesting meteorological event. Thunderstorms tomorrow along the Gulf Coast. Thunderstorms up toward New England tomorrow. Cold front in the center of the nation. Thunder showers up toward the northern Rockies for tomorrow. Satellite image here. There are the thunderstorms in Old Mexico. They just did not quite make it into the area tonight. And still some spotty rains in parts of East Texas as well, where the rains continue falling there. Super radar shows that there is some spotty precipitation along the eastern part of our country, back into Florida, right along the Gulf Coast, into the southeastern part of our country, and then big storms from the front range of Colorado and the plains of Colorado, right up to Nebraska, southwestern Minnesota tonight as well. Around here, just one thunderstorm over uh, north of the Dell City area in New Mexico, and that's about it. We move on to temperatures around the country. Pick out your favorite location right now. It's 77 for Dallas, Austin, San Antonio, and Houston. Boy, is that easy on the weatherman tonight. And 80 degrees down in Brownsville. Regional temperatures, 80 in Lubbock, 79 Midland, 83 in Deming, 85 in TRC, 83 in Alamogordo, 80 in Las Cruces, 82 in El Paso. The highs for tomorrow, well, folks, the 100s have snuck up on the doorstep one more time. Then come the 90s over much of the country, the 80s. We run it out with the 70s up by Seattle, up by Duluth, and up by beautiful downtown Bangor, Maine for tomorrow. And tomorrow is Monday. June the 26th, sunrise 602, sunset 815, no records tonight, and don't look for a record high tomorrow. So tonight you may expect a low of 68 under partly cloudy skies. Tomorrow, 100 sunny and hot as we move on to Sunday, or make that the day after. How about Monday, 101, on Tuesday, 101-ish, Wednesday, upper 90s. So, couldn't get any rain in this weekend, sorry about that. And tomorrow, Ted Bender returns. I'll be gone for a couple of weeks. Talia and I will do weather next weekend, and I'm going to Milwaukee and talk some sense to those brewer bats in Milwaukee. <laughs> well, maybe Talia can bring some rain next week. That's we'll see right. what happens. All right, thanks a lot, John. Okay. Thank you, John. Well, it might be called a race for the rosaries. 